Hello, welcome once again to Morgate Andrology. I'm delighted as always to be joined by Dr. Abbas Kadra, urologist at Morgate Andrology. Now, one of the questions that we get asked a lot when patients first inquire about penis fillers is how thick is it possible or how much thicker is it possible to get the penis? And Dr. Kadra hopefully can help us answer that question today. So Dr. Kadra, how, how thick can you get a penis? If a guy wants his penis thickened, what's possible? You can get quite a large size. Uh, certainly from the research I've done in terms of the trial I did uh, four years ago, we used just 10 mils of filler. And we found with just 10 mils, you can get two centimeter increase in thickness. Everybody gets that. Really? Yes, that's definitely. You have to measure the circumference and then we would add two centimeters to that. With that okay. Thickness. You have to also take into account that it depends on the length of the penis that you already have. Mm -hmm. So if you have a penis that's what I call, some of the boys, the lads will say pencil penis, uh -huh. they tend to be long, thin. So that, that will need far more filler than somebody who has a yeah. shortish penis. Uh -huh. So the result will appear more prominent with the shorter guy than the longer guy. Mm -hmm. So then with the longer guys, you need to go for more filler. Certainly from my experience here is whereby uh, the patients are having it done for the first time, they all tend to go for between 15 to 20 mils of filler. 15 to 20 mils. Which is a start, start of one. Mm -hmm. With that, you will get a minimum of uh, certainly, I would say, uh, two to three centimeters in increase in, in girth. Depending on the length of the shaft. Correct. Yeah. If the shaft is short, then you would certainly hit up to four centimeter. Mm -hmm. If it's short, because that volume you're going to put in that smaller space. Mm -hmm. Whereas if you have a longish penis, you will most definitely get your two centimeter, if not three. Okay. Now tell me this. I hear that when you uh, add this uh, hyaluronic acid to thicken the penis, it also can make it look a bit longer. Is Correct. this true? Yes. Why does this true. happen? The reason being is when you add the filler, the penis will project forward more. A lot of patients will tell you that actually when I sit down, my penis shrinks inwards. But when you have the filler adding on the sides, it doesn't allow it to go in. So it projects ah, forward down. Right. So uh, subjectively, they all reported, again, this is from data I collected, they all report a two centimeter increase in length subjectively that okay. they look in themselves and the penis has never looked the same it's always looking longer okay and lots of guys talk about their penis being a different size depending on what they're doing if they get out of a hot bath they say oh it looks great if i go out walking in the minus five degrees i come back in it's very short right. now will that situation change after fillers or is your penis always a sort of barometer, if you wish? There is an element of that still happening, but it will never happen to the degree you used to happen. Uh, certainly because you've got the filler there. Mm -hmm. So as I said, it is the, the, skin, the skin has been stretched. You're going to have more skin uh, with time. So, and I always tell my patients, you will never get back to where you started. That even when the filler dissolves after two years, you'll end up where it 30% increase which is permanent because the body creates like a lining under the skin where the filler used to be to, to give you that extra girth. Wow, um, and what is this lining that it creates? Collagen? It creates like uh, collagen tissue, yeah. it promotes that to happen, the body automatically does that, which is nice, it's like, it's like having your natural uh, graft material because uh, we have got procedure where we put uh, artificial graft material under the skin, mm -hmm. whereas now your body will create its own lining which gives you that, 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 that thickness. So yeah, uh, penis never goes back to the original size. And in terms of uh, guys who are coming for a first treatment, what's your advice in terms of volume? Because it seems to be there are, you know, parameters, shall we say, depending on what you're looking to achieve. What, what would your advice be? Again, as I said, it all depends on the length. Mm -hmm. If they've got stretchy tissue and the penis is, is uh, what I call in the flaccid state is uh, a good length, say more than five inches. These guys need to start at 20 mils right. to, to get a good result because the, the skin will stretch. And even when I'm putting the filler in, the filler is, is getting distributed very nicely. There's a larger surface area. Uh -huh. So, but for the smaller guys, 
uh, you could definitely 15. No, I wouldn't advise anything less than 15 less to than get 15, a yeah. good result that you'll be happy with. Because yeah. I know what they want. They're coming in because they want to see that difference. That, that they want yeah. the wow factor. They yeah, want to go course, see, wow, it looks much bigger. Yeah. And the nice thing about this procedure is immediately after the procedure, you have, we have the pictures taken, they can see it. So the results are immediate. Immediate can... results. Yeah. Yeah. Very good. So there you go. If you want to know more about uh, penis enlargement injections, then do get in touch with us here at Morgate Andrology. We can arrange a consultation for you with Dr. Kadra. And also you'll find a lot more information at our website at www.morgateandrology.co.uk. So until next time, that's all from us today. Bye for now.